Sora 2 just dropped, and today I'll show you how to build a complete automation that takes you from a simple text prompt all the way to a finished video, fully hands-off, directly inside N8N. This workflow connects Airtable, Nano Banana, and Sora 2. So every time you click Execute, it will automatically generate your image, create a cinematic animation, and update everything back in your database. Whether you want to create AI video content for social media, client projects, or product showcases, this system gives you a repeatable, scalable way to do it. No manual steps required. Let me first show you an example. Hey, if you're into AI automations, you need to check out Automation Tribe on School. That's where I learned to build powerful workflows and scale my projects fast. As you can see, with a detailed prompt and a clear voiceover text, you'll get this 3D character with a professional and polished look. With this automation, you can create content like a pro in just a few minutes. Now, I'll show you exactly how to build it and how the automation runs step by step. And at the end, I'll share more examples so you can see just how powerful this system really is. I started an Airtable where I added this prompt. It's quite detailed. Then I set the image size, selected the output format, and wrote the voiceover text. I also chose the video size. Please note that the first option for the image size includes multiple formats because Nano Banana now supports several output dimensions. For the video size, you can currently choose only between landscape and portrait mode. Make sure you select the correct version when generating so the output matches your project requirements. After that, I clicked on the Execute Workflow button in N8N. It takes around 10 minutes to generate a video. I won't start a new one right now because this tutorial will be finished before the rendering is complete. Let me show you how I built this automation. First, you need to set up an Airtable base with the following columns. I'll walk you through each one and explain what they do along with their field types. In Airtable, I created several columns to manage the entire process. First, the prompt field, set as long text, where I write the detailed description for the video. Then, the status field, a single select, to track the progress such as to do or done. Next, the image size field, a single select, with multiple formats supported by Nano Banana. The output field, also single select, defines the image format like PNG. The voiceover field is long text, used for the narration script. Then, the video size field, single select, where you can choose landscape or portrait. The attachments field stores the image generated with Nano Banana. The animation prompt field is long text, used to send the description to Sora 2. This is generated dynamically based on the initial prompt and the voiceover. And finally, the final video field, single line text, saves the video after rendering. Now let's move to N8N. Here, you need to create a new workflow. The first node is execute workflow. The second one is a set node. Here I'll set the API key for the service I'll use. In my case, I'm using Kai.ai. I always like to set my API keys at the beginning because then I don't have to replace them in all the HTTP request nodes. I simply reference them in my other nodes. The third node is search records from Airtable. Make sure you select the right Airtable base and the correct table, and then add the following formula you see on the screen. This formula is very important. If you set the status in Airtable as to do and run the automation, it will only process that particular row. If you want to create three simultaneous jobs, set all three rows with the status to do, then click Execute Workflow. The automation will start and generate all of them. Next, we have an HTTP request node. If you look inside, you'll see all my settings. You can also find these settings on the KIE.AI website, but you don't have to search for them anymore. Please pause the video and copy the details. The next node is a wait node. I set this option to 30 or 40 seconds. Next, there's another HTTP request node. This one is used to retrieve the image generated by Nano Banana. 
After that, I added a set node. I'm using it to clean the result from the previous step. Key.ai sometimes returns a complex response, so this extra node helps extract a clean image URL. The next node is update record from Airtable. With this one, I update the record and add the image into the attachments field. Next, we have a node from OpenAI. What's important here is the prompt. Please pause the video and copy my prompt or create your own version. The following node is another wait node. I set it to 20 seconds because sometimes the URL from Nano Banana isn't updated instantly in Airtable. There's usually a short delay, so this ensures the image is properly stored before moving to the next step. Next, we move to the Sora 2 node, the new model from OpenAI, which is truly impressive. Please make sure to use the same settings I'm showing here, exactly as they appear. After that, we add another wait node. I won't open it now, but make sure to set it to 10 minutes or even more. Right now, the servers are very busy, so the rendering process may take longer than expected. The next node is another HTTP request, where I retrieve the result from the Sora 2 API. Here, you need to include the query parameters, the task ID, and, of course, the authorization header. Then I add a set node again to clean the URL returned by key.ai, so we have a simple usable link. Finally, the last node is update record in Airtable. Here, I add the final video URL to the record and change the status to done. Now let me show you another example. First, I'll show you the image, and then I'll show you the video. And that's how you can build a complete Sora 2 automation in N8N. Hey, quick heads. Automation Tribe on School is open right now and it's filling fast. Inside you get live workflows, plug and play templates, and direct access to builders who actually ship. But the launch price? It's about... Confidence isn't about what you wear. It's how you wear it. Bold moves, clean lines, timeless style. This is where street meets luxury. Who's got the best automations? Automation Tribe. They build some of the best automations out there. Check them out at automation-tribe.com and start automating smarter. If you'd like to download this full workflow, it's available inside my school community, Automation Tribe. When you join, you'll also get access to all 44 powerful automations, step-by-step -step blueprints, and direct support whenever you need help. Plus, Membership gives you access to my platform, where you can generate video shorts automatically in just a few clicks. You'll find the links in the description. I'll see you inside the community.